And we're back with another Wii Cry Stop! We're your hosts, I'm the RPG Guy. With me is the lovely Me Plus. And also hiding out in her den of evil, the sweet overlord of overlord of darkness. Gently Maze. falling asleep. Gently falling asleep. Maze. Oh, it... she didn't like you saying her name. Oh no, don't smite me, oh dark lord, please. And we have... Finally collected them all. Make sure to make the uh, thumbnail for this the Infinity Gauntlet with, with all the primes. She really, she very, she like leaves a white <laughs> phrase around it. Just that would be really funny. Uh, so we finally we went on the hunt, and it took what a month and a half to find all of these, give or take. Yeah. So yeah it took us a while the red the green and the blue were probably the easiest to find followed actually we didn't have a lot of trouble finding the yellow one yo super dude you can go to the store right now and get the yellow one. yeah there, we found that easily the pink one was tricky uh the grape one was probably the most difficult which we have a special thing going on with that one and then these two were about as difficult strangely enough as the pink one but and the orange one was actually difficult to find but we had found them yeah, you know what's crazy is I was actually showing off the collection, <laughs> and uh, Irish U said, Damn, you guys must be rich. And I'm like, Why? They're like two to three bucks here. And he said, They're six euro over in Ireland. That's six and a half US dollars each. Yeah, well, it's important, though. That, yeah, that's a lot, though. That's that's a lot. That is insane. So, Even May's like, What? Yeah. Seven dollars for a drink? Yeah, that's that's a lot for a hydration drink, which is what these are. Now, if you, just as a heads up, we have a video where we try all of the energy drinks that we could find. That we could find. Um, and before we start with this lovely assortment of Prime, we actually are going to make up for what we didn't do in the, the, the last episode, which is this pink uh, Prime here. And the new flavor that came out recently, which is... Ice pop or rocket, as people have been known. But we about. have every damn flavor there is possible, except for that pre-order one, which is except for the pre-order one and thirdly rare. And it I only guess was, except for the powders, but the powders are just the powders, powders. Just this stuff, and maybe we'll do a we try the powders. Yeah, my Sam's the powders end up tasting good, and we're like. But this is Logan Paul's smorgasbord. But we are going to start with these. Now, we were able to finally get this one, but we had already recorded the episode. Look at the cutting on the green one. It's way lower. Yeah, they're not evenly uh, made. That's not that interesting. Yeah. So we're going to start with the Strawberry Watermelon Prime Energy Drink. Um, and uh, we've not had this flavor in any rendition, right? Because we haven't tried any of this yet. So would you like to do the honor? Oh, hell yeah. I hope it tastes good, dude. I like strawberry and watermelon shit. Yeah. But then we wonder if this it, stuff's gonna taste exactly like the energy drink. It smells pretty... It, it smells like somebody melted a watermelon jelly rancher in a fucking LaCroix. Snip it! <laughs> oh my god, you're right. <clears throat> oh, we weren't super fond of the energy drinks, mainly because we've had a lot of different energy drinks over the years. And we... We mainly our go-to is G Fuel in powder form, or like uh, occasionally some of the other ones that we find at the store randomly. But I mean, we like the lemon. I believe we like the lime one, right? The lemon lime. I think it was lemon lime, but it might have just been. I think it was lemon lime. We like that one, and we like the blue raspberry one. I think, and then the other two were kind of meh. But definitely check that episode out because God, that was the second episode we ever did. Was the primes. The energy drink. So I think it tastes good. It it, it, it bites a bit. I don't know if that's just because I'm hungry or whatever, but... You know what it is? This is as good as that blue raspberry one. But it was, I don't think it's as good as the lemon lime. No, I think this one has the most flavor yet. That? I'll give you this. It's better than the blue raspberry. I, I'd have to try the lemon lime one side by side, but... Yeah. This is definitely an improvement uh, over the mango orange. Yeah, like I sat the, there and took multiple sips yeah. of that. I don't recall doing that for this any bad. of the fucking others. Do I get to do this one? Yeah. You're more of a connoisseur of the rocket flavor. 
Yeah, and we got a box of Philly Swirl mixes from uh, Smart and Final, and uh, I've been destroying the they're ice pop. Mixes, they're popsicles. Well, they're popsicles, but they're mixed flavor. There's different flavors in it. Oh. Mixed in, and I, you're not a big fan of the Rocket ones in there. Besides. Rocket just tastes like cardboard and aluminum cans to and me. To me, it's nostalgic for me because those were what I did ate. Did anybody? Did anybody know what the fuck I'm talking about? So this is Prime Ice Pop. I think that the strawberry watermelon... This doesn't, t this doesn't taste like Ice Pop. This tastes like... I won't say it. Say it. What the fuck? It smells like cinnamon buns. <laughs> well, okay, it doesn't... Okay, we'll go for it. What? Why does it smell like cinnamon buns? <laughs> Why does it taste like cinnamon buns? Oh, it doesn't taste like cinnamon buns to me, but it tastes like... It tastes um, like cinnamon buns, yeah. but like you put a fucking cherry airhead on it top of it. It tastes like that handcrafted Japanese cola I had made by Asahi. Oh, it has a weird aftertaste. What the yeah. fuck is that? Ah! For those of you who are not familiar, we try a lot of different beverages and foods from all over the world, and we've had, we've gone through a gauntlet of different Japanese things, and it reminds me of one of those handcrafted sodas. Doesn't doesn't make me think ice pop, does it? There's a hint of ice pop. You're liking it a lot more than most people. No, no, this is better. Uh, this I think the blue raspberry is actually better than this one. Um, but so I think strawberry watermelon one has like a nerd taste. It really, it really just. You know. Yeah, you're probably right. Oh, yeah, hurt. A little bit. This is the superior one. Yeah. The uh, the strawberry watermelon. Uh, ice pop. I, I almost taste like a like a like a soda rather than an uh, ice pop. You'll be hearing a little bit of that. You're all eager. Yeah, it has like a fucking cinnamon bun smell to it. <laughs> what the fuck? Sniff it and think about cinnamon buns. It smells like icing. I don't know about cinnamon. Okay, okay, maybe icing? Maybe. <laughs> I don't know, I'm getting hit of, I like that spice of cinnamon in there. But it tastes like like a like a soda, like a flavored like an orange or like a regular cola with orange flavoring or cherry flavoring. Something like that. I'll give you that. A cherry cola. It tastes like like one of the Japanese cherry sodas or something. And how cherry cola tastes like cinnamon buns to me as well, I don't know. No, it's definitely it's not the worst flavor. It's not as bad as the the red one and the, the, the fruit punch, I think it was, and the, the orange makeup. Yeah, this one's pretty. So we'll, we'll move on for what y'all are here to actually watch. Um, but yeah, so I would say this is probably below... They don't know what you're pointing to. The, 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 this one is below the... or around the area of the blue raspberry energy, right? Strawberry, I would say, is kind of tied with a lemon lime. Maybe. It might depend on your temperament. So let's get started. Yeah. So we have organized these in some format. We're going to start. In rainbow. Not rarity, except for at the end here. Just rainbow. Well, that, and even strangely enough, they're kind of in the order of almost in what we project might be the worst to possibly the best in this area. And then. What? No, I think here. the lemonade one's got to taste pretty okay. Oh, okay. Well, we're going to get started, so the first one we're going to do is Prime Hydration Drink Tropical Punch. You can taste it, taste it, tropics, my friend. Oh, you should you should say what we heard about the canned ones. Oh, what? That somebody, some kid drank so much of it they went in cardiac arrest or something? Apparently, the cans of Prime have as much caffeine in them as six cans of cold. Allegedly. Allegedly. Well, cola, okay, but we looked at a chart. Cola has like 60 milligrams, 
That has says on it it has 200. I think it says it has 200. Um, 200 milligrams of caffeine. So be careful when taking these or giving them to your kids or whatever. Yeah, energy drinks in general because there's energy drinks stronger than that. Well, there's some in the three and four hundred range. Tropical Punch Prime. Now these are caffeine free. So we have no qualms with kids sucking these down other than and they're low in calories, unlike a Gatorade. I don't know, man. 25 calories a serving. Keep an eye on your kid. Um, you might want to check some of the ingredients too, but they're high in potassium. If you drink, if you consume too much potassium, kids, you can actually hurt your this kidneys. This contains tree nuts, so anyone allergic to tree nuts, don't drink this. Yeah. Um, because of the coconut, yeah. And so there's some things in here, but it's generally not too bad for hydration drinks. Is coconut? Milk coconut. Are we supposed to refrigerate these? No. No, we should be fine. Okay. We open it. Here we go. Here we go. Got all these just to be a fuck up. Nah, nah. Sniffy. Smells like Kool Aid. That's actually what happened the last time, right? We smelled the fruit punch one and it smelled exactly like Kool Aid. I don't remember shit, dude. I, luckily, I do. I, I, I believe I do. You should I go? Should you, would you like to do the honors or should I? Uh, you, go for you sure? I, hold on. She's figuring out if we rotate which one she gets to try first. Mm. You should go first. Bye. You get to try the blue one. You get to try. Okay, yeah. Yeah. I'm trying first. <laughs> you, me, you, me, you. Aww. Me, you, me, you. Yeah. <laughs> Should I even say anything? You're like. I shouldn't have said a word. I'm just gonna drink this energy drink in shame. Yes, it does smell like it, sm it smells like cherry or tropical. No, cherry Kool Aid. Or fruit punch Kool Aid. Which we did not like in the energy drink. It's like dank Kool Aid. I think it tastes okay. I think it's got a thicker texture to it than the candy one did. This tastes okay with what it is versus the energy drink flavors. You know what I mean? Like how this flavor works with the coconut water and it works as a hydration drink. But when it was in this, the flavor of the energy drink stuff that gives it that kick. Oh, Tari? Yeah, contrasts mm -hmm. this flavor. Maybe. Okay. It's not bad. Um. This would not be. I don't know. I haven't had. Hold the on. Other... We got it. We gotta say what it tastes like. Like Kool Aid. Does it? You said that the last one didn't taste like. What do you mean? You said this of the canned one that we sniffed. It did, it did taste like Kool-Aid. Oh. It tastes like dank, bad Kool-Aid. This tastes like dank it Smells like cherry. Cherry and like orange and bullshit. Yeah, well, it didn't mean fruit punch. I mean, it didn't taste good with the energy drink. This is much better. I still don't prefer it. And this tastes like a fake sweetener, which is probably why how they get it sweet. You know. Yeah, it just tastes a coin punch. Yeah, uh, yeah. You got mostly cherry, a little bit of orange back there. Um, that is probably closer. Hawaiian punch. Um, that and Kool Aid maybe mixed together. You know, we can't just be the people. That yeah, that one tasted okay, I guess. No, no, no. We, 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 should, we <laughs> should definitely put a little more effort into this. Alright, so this is mine, right? Yeah. Orange. Not orange mango. Orange. Which I believe orange mango was the exclusive flavor for the people who pre-ordered in, like, Europe. Oh. The, it only says KSI at the top, too. It's like KSI orange mango. It's in a black bottle. We got fucked, dude. I love mango. I know. Well, you didn't like the orange mango flavor at all. That was the worst flavor in oh, the Oh, wait. Game. We had an orange mango of the can? Of the can, yeah. Oh. That was actively the worst flavor. 
like aggressively. So maybe they, there's a reason why that only came with a special order. They tried it with the hydration drinks after doing it with the <laughs> there, and they were just like. They're all sitting around like, oh, that tastes like ass. We made like. Dude, you know it'd be funny though. <laughs> we, made, yeah, we made 100 gallons of it. Should we just pour it out? Oh, I have an idea. <laughs> Now, strangely enough, this is 25 calories. This one's 20 calories. So we got a, a big difference here. I'm not going to read all the crap that's Which in this. Which means, if my fatness means anything, that that one tastes worse. By default. It smells exactly like orange Gatorade. I don't know, I always drink blue. No? What? Wait, what? It's orange Gatorade, but I like a caramel smell to it as well. No, like a candy smell. It smells like or orange candy. Orange candy? And I'm getting like caramel. Dude, sniff it. No, I like an orange candy. Maybe orange candy green. Maybe. Maybe green. Like it's orange candy, like right? The or up like the lifesaver swirls. Like it's orange candy all up front, dude. I don't know where the hell. Did I put those on the shelf? Yeah, they're on the shelf somewhere. Okay. We actually found some. This is entirely orange, and then right at the end, it's like cream or caramel or something. <laughs> so it smells way better than it's gonna fucking taste. Perfect. It doesn't taste like orange Gatorade, strangely enough. It's very, like, melted orange pop. Like an orange icicle. Like an orange creamsicle? I don't know about the creamsicle part of it. It's got a, it's got a, like a, a creamy musk, maybe. It's nice. It's mild? It tastes like how I said it smelled, but it's mild. For anybody wondering, the, the beverages are the color that these bottles are, for the most part. So, they're orange, red. I know a lot of people get fancy. What color is that one? That's what we're going to find out. I think these are both white, briefly enough. But I figure, you know. Oh, we could have had cool glasses. We don't have glasses for all this. We don't. We only have those four that we have. This isn't as bad as I thought. I was. I thought it was going to be cringy. Cringeworthy. I think that tasted pretty good. I think, some, I think it's better than the fruit punch. Yeah. What is it? Yeah. We're gonna just we're not gonna no, we're gonna reorganize these by favorite once we get further into the tasting here. But hand me that lemon I eat. Oh yeah, so this is the newest flavor that came out recently, right? Mm -hmm. Got a big old dent right there. Yeah, they they did not send ship those well to people. Uh, we did not pre-order it, but we went to the store. Our grocery store actually had the lemon and there was like hundreds of them but they all had dents i couldn't even find one without a dent in it and so this is the big new flavor that they're promoting oh what i saw the like recycling rates here and i thought it was a different language entirely <laughs> i was like what it's interesting like how on the bottles too the printing is not exactly in the same location like that's different that's different these were all from you know local i don't like the ones no, i have to drink that one first just to save you let you know what pain and suffering is coming does it smell does it taste like ksi's armpit <laughs> logan paul's wet butt crack somebody's like ew you guys are gross of course we are You should see, we've had Nato on this show, man, and we liked it. Booyah! It kind of smells like a cleaner. Yeah, you know? It kind of smells like a pine saw. Mm-hmm. Sure. I, think, I think it's pine saw, but it's a lot It's a lot weakened. It's not as pungent as, as, as pine saw. No, it hit me. I went... I have to drink this. I don't like that. I don't like it. It's not offensive. I don't like it though. It's like a mild lemon. 
It's like a, it's like a, a, a wet, no, I don't know how to, it's not. A soggy it's like a, a cloth that you put its, a lemon on. It's almost like it's past ripeness. It's got a dull lemon flavor that just, it, it, milk you it, it tastes soggy, I don't know. It reminds me of a soggy cloth. I don't know if it's because it smells like cleaning I product remember, or what. I remember one time I had chewed on an old lemon. I was dying of hunger. And uh, all I had was water and a lemon wedge in it. And the lemon, like, it, the guy brought them in a bowl. And they looked like they were old. They were, like, brownish. The flesh was, like, brownish yellow. But I nibbled on them. It reminds me of that, like a bad lemon. Um, not a fan. Not a fan of that one. That's probably the worst one we've had so far. It's not offensive. It's just It's not for us. Yeah. It, there's no, it's not it's not like the the energy drinks where there was the orange mango was clearly <laughs> offensive to our yeah. senses. And the fruit punch one wasn't much better. At least it isn't the popcorn. So here is the winner of the four uh, the last episode flavor, lemon lime. So does it translate here? Now this one's twenty calories. The lemon one is twenty-five, so it's interesting how one, two, three, four of these are 25, or 20, and then the rest are 25. That's interesting why some are more calories than the, than the other. And the bottle sizes and all the ingredients look exactly the same. Even the sugar count is the same. So, is that an oversight, maybe? So, <laughs> as you can see, this one is yellow, kind of a milky yellow. It tastes milky. Yeah, that's yeah. Maybe, and then this one's like a like a dank little green color. Maybe they put too much coconut water. Not enough like lemon flavoring. Maybe, maybe. Talk about that's a little. Oh. Yeah, it's, it's it's not. I mean, it's not. We've had. I mean, it's it's. We've creamy? had actively nasty stuff on this show, like beverage wise and food wise. There's no, so far nothing has completely shut us off from the... If somebody handed me one of those three, I'd still drink it. What's it say? Oh, it says something on all of these. Prime was developed to fill the void for great taste beats function with bold, thirst-quenching flavors to help you refresh, replenish, and refuel. Prime is the perfect boost for every endeavor. We're confident you'll love it as much as we do. Humbly, the Prime team. That's Humbly, huh? Humbly, my ass. I've seen your, your advertising. <laughs> When I was, you know, looking for pictures. Humbly, Mr. Paul? Humbly is, uh, more prime, more prime. Okay, so, mm -hmm. this smells like lemon lime Gatorade. This, this smells exactly like it. Um, but it smells good. Like, the good smell that came from lemon lime beverages. That initial first taste was not great, but then it got really good after. But you'll see what I mean. I'm, I, I know I said something, but... Did we say what the orange one tasted like? Yes, we did. Okay, wait, wait, I'm just making sure I don't fall by it. It smells like jello. Green lemon lime flavored jello, yeah. We saved a jello. Green lime flavored jello. Bring me a pool full of green lime flavored jello so I can jump into it and deprive it its delicious goodness. Yes. Sorry. It doesn't taste like green li lemon lime flavor. No, it tastes like it tastes like lemon lime Gatorade. I don't think I ever Ex tried that one. Except, well, it was the original, but um, it's it's a little different. Again, it's that milkiness. I think it's the, it's got to be the coconut water. Coconut milk. The coconut milk. Coconut water. You either like it or you don't. I mean. I think it's okay. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I, this is probably my favorite one so far. Now hold on just a minute there, sir. I don't know. The challenge. This now tastes like Skittles. <laughs> oh no. Uh, it's begun. Here. No. No. You know what this tastes like? An orange charms pop. Like those lollipops. Mm -hmm. Remember, like we have some charms over there yeah. we got at the Korean market. It kind of tastes like an orange one of those. Doesn't it? 
She likes the orange, but I like the lemon lime. You know what? I'll let you have the lemon lime. Okay. I'll let you. I'll let, you want to try the lemon lime again, though? Try it again. Well, we still got some. Yeah, got... I'm not saying you can chug it. I'm saying this is number one right now. By by what? Like a an eight and nats butt hair. They do taste pretty similar to me, in the grand scheme of things. But I tend, I, I... At least it isn't red, and especially at least it isn't yellow. Alright, so this one's next. This is the <laughs> blue raspberry to to take on. Like, if somebody handed me, I'll give you an example, if somebody handed me an orange mango or fruit punch flavored prime energy drink, I would be like, nah, nah I'm okay. I'll wait till I get. This smells like a blue raspberry lollipop. You ever? That was like my favorite flavor of blue. I mean, like a Jolly Rancher. I've never no, seen... you never had blue raspberry like the Dum Dums. No, I've actually never had a blue raspberry Dum Dum. Oh, I've had like. I used to love them as a kid. I used to like the mystery flavor and the root beer. I mean, I'd go for the mystery flavors too, but you can't say that was your favorite, is it? No, oh, yeah. yeah. No, it wasn't the mystery one. It was a different one. There was a white one. You are grinning. You have the, the shit-eating grin on your face. So for you, those of you at home, this one's actually kind of white. Whitish. A blue. So, I'm saying that wins over Lemon Lime. Oh, me too. This is the sweetest of all of them. You've never had a blue raspberry dumbbell? She's gonna find. We don't have blue raspberry dumbbells, do we? Like, I'm going to buy you some. Ooh. If I did, I didn't know I That's good. Yeah, that's definitely the best one so far. <laughs> Alright, so we're moving on. You ready? Put the phone away. <laughs> hey, we'll get some, okay? Prompt. When is it another story? I used to like the blue raspberry ones, the <laughs> cotton candy ones, and the butterscotch ones. The butterscotch ones, I Yeah, they had like the... It's not the mystery, it's the butterscotch They had like the rectangle. Oh. Yeah. That's the, yeah, that's the one I'm thinking of, not the mystery. All right, we're moving on to strawberry watermelon. Uh, now, this was arguably one of your favorite flavors. Oh, she's so cute. You okay? She looks okay. She just out. No, she's experiencing REM. She's with her eyes, eyes open. Oh my goodness, she is. She's sleeping with her eyes open. It's crazy. The whites of her eyes are turning color. Yeah, uh, wake her up. Hey! You okay? Huh? <laughs> you guys sleep with your eyes closed, Dad. You okay? I'm gonna put her under the thing. You wanna put her in her cave? You wanna go under your cave, baby? Thank you. Yeah, put her in her cave. I think, I think it'd be better for her eyes. Sometimes our dog sleeps with her eyes open. And, um, sometimes our dog sleeps with her eyes open. You want to go under your blanket? And, uh, it's disturbing when you see it. Um, but we know that, oh. what we read, that it's probably better that she sleeps Are you a good girl? In, in the dark. Are you a good girl? We love you. No, <laughs> we do. Go on. Good girl. Okay. Alright. So now <laughs> I'm gonna try the strawberry watermelon. One of the 20 calorie ones. I guess it's my turn to try it, right? Yeah. Smells promising. Actually, you know now that we have this. This smells sweeter than this. I'm not going to try these side by side. I don't know if that's a good idea. Maybe after we've tried all of them, you know what I mean? Okay. 
and very milky. Well, I mean, that sounds good to me. Watermelon milk? Watermelon strawberry milk. <laughs> I'm gonna try them both. There's a slight difference. It's subtle. This is sorry. This smells a lot more powerful, just in general. It's the same smell, but this is like more. That's fair. <sighs> you said we should try them after you open? Yeah, yeah, let's taste mm -hmm. all of this and then we can try these two alongside their 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 brother sister flavor, whatever you want to call it. I don't think it's better than the blue raspberry. Oh, that's right, you already tried it. No, I don't like this one. I think that's like red tear, maybe orange tear. Yeah, I was gonna say that too. Maybe even well, <coughs> no. no, no, no. Lemon, lemon's higher than these two, right? No, lemon's the worst. No, no, I meant. I'm sorry. Lower on this. Okay, yeah. so you're saying it's more in here, between the two of them. Yeah, not a fan of that one too much. Um. Could be better now i'm going to explain this grape one um this one was literally the hardest one to find um and we have a viewer who is obsessed with collecting all the bottles so guess what that viewer whose name is i guess i could say his first name, right <laughs> yeah. like i okay jerry these are for you now we um he's tried every flavor that's here Except this one. So what we're gonna do, and he's local, he's a local local viewer, is we brought a glass that we're gonna drink the great prime out of, and we're gonna save him a little bit of this prime just for you, Jerry. But we're gonna try it here on the show first. He'll have probably tried it and gotten this by the time uh, this episode comes out, so uh you know, that'll be great. But we are going to pour probably the majority of this and leave what's left, maybe to here. Yeah. You, think, you know, just oh, just pour like you know mm -hmm. half of it. Do this. Oh, well, we didn't do half. It's still up to here. I'm gonna pour a little bit more. Okay. Oh my god, I can smell it from here. Yeah, it's pungent. <clears throat> that is grape. It is American artificial grape scent. To the nth degree. Now, we've liked Japanese grapes. Look at that color, though. That's a nice color. It's like a like a, a fine, like a cheap wine. So, this is a very chemically grapes. I don't know. This is not promising. Oh. But uh, we're going to drink this out of the glass. For Jerry. That way Jerry can drink this out of the bottle if he so chooses. Hands are clean, you know. It's done. Hey, this is supposed to be my first sip. I will let you do this one too. I'm sorry. I was preparing the sample. <laughs> and I was just... Eh. It's got like a Werther's or a Tootsie smell to it? It's a very chemical smell. No, it's... <laughs> to me, anyway. It's like an old people candy smell. Oh, that's fair, yeah, but I don't know if I'd say Werther's. Kind of like an old grape candy. Actually, it's very close to the... It's the, like... No, it's the like... The charms, the, the grape like, Not even charms. grape, like, sniff it. It's got like an old, old, like, Tootsie... Were there something, Old something, candy factory. something that's like right out of their pocket? Here you go. Did you try it? No, not yet. I'm okay, Minis. <laughs> she looked worried. Papa, are you okay? I want to see if she says what I'm thinking. It's like a 
wild grape lollipop. Yeah, they, we're getting a lot of lollipop flavors from some of these, right? Like it's out of blue. You are, I think. Well, okay, and the blue is for me. Yeah. Well, you free you, and then the well, orange for me. Well, this isn't even like a like a dumb dumb quality. This no, is like, it's it's charms. It's like those cheap. Yeah, it's like an nickel, old nickel old lollipop. grape candy. Yeah. From like this ain't even sweet 80s, enough to be the one 70s. that you get from the fucking barber or dentist or whatever. Yeah, those are the charms. Those no, are charms. this ain't even that good. Oh, ooh. So, do we have a new worst flavor or what? Is it as bad as the lemon? I want to drink it all. I need to try some of that now. Because I, I'm torn. I don't... I still think I that... could drink this. You could? I don't think I would be happy drinking the prime, the green... The, the purple one. The great... Saying every color but the color itself. Yeah, I guess you're right. I can see that. This is more polarizing than this. Even if I'm considering it... Now, there's probably people who really like that flavor, but... I'm just not a grape person. I like grape stuff. Um, I don't like that. <laughs> I'll like, like, Japanese grape flavors, maybe, but... I like I like American grape flavors. Um, I'm a I, I prefer white grape juice over regular grape juice. But I drink grape juice in many formats. I used to drink white grape juice all the time. So, I will say that probably the grape one, which was the hardest to find, is probably the least good so far. So there you go. <laughs> all right, we're well. Wait a minute, so far because we still got two more left. We're moving on to. Uh, you get to open both of the non-standard flavors here. Because I, like a jerk, open the grape one. I can't help it. I, it's my my OCD-ish. My OCD-ness a little bit, trying to get it all. You don't have OCD? I don't, I don't know why I want to keep messing with them. I'm so, I'm odd. They don't smell the same? The canned one smells better. Yeah. This is starting to smell more like a cherry soda. But this, okay, this smells nicer, but it doesn't smell like, like a, a rocket pop. That smells like a rocket pop. Yeah, I guess. This almost smells like cotton candy. Nope. Maybe she's being okay. This actually smells more like cotton candy. Eh, I don't see that. More like a can We actually have some cotton candy soda we haven't had yet uh, over there for another episode. We're gonna try 10 flavors of Faco. As well as, we also have, I believe, every flavor of Sangaria Ramune another episode as well. So remember, hit like the video. Did we say what the subscribe. pink one tasted like? You didn't like... Oh, this or this? That. You didn't like this. Or did we say what it tasted like? The pink one. It did not taste like that. You said something akin to like a strawberry milk. or We can go back and revisit it again. I mean, that's that's why we're not sucking these down until completion. You know? Yeah, this tastes closer to an ice pop than than the energy drink. Yeah. That tastes more like some kind of cherry cola, the the energy drink version. It's like a strawberry lemonade. You don't taste any of the watermelon? No. Yeah, you're right. It is more like a strawberry lemonade. There you go. So that's the flavor for that one. Okay. Uh, the ice pop. Ice pop tastes like ice pop. It's I actually, don't like it. It's, it's, um, I would say it's better than these two. The, the grape and the lemon. Yeah. It floats in this area. Yeah. I actually prefer it over the two that are here, but only by a sliver. 
And mm. with the problem of these beverages being extremely hard to find right now, I would I would not go out of my way to find this. Luckily, we didn't have to special order anything. We just went to liquor stores. Uh, we went to what, like twelve different liquor stores, mm -hmm. and we found actually, strangely enough, we found the last four at a grocery store, which were the or, no, we found the orange at a liquor store. What were the ones at the grocery store? The lemon, the ice pop, and the and the it's last a creamy one, ice the Meta Moon. Too. Yeah, I don't think that's a bad thing. And then, of course, we found mm. this one and this one and this one at the grocery store. Alright, I'll give you that the ice pop tastes better. It's subtle, and it's... I'm starting to think the red tastes better than the orange. Well, we can go back and figure that out once we get to the, the nasty revisits. Look. I'm gonna let you snake this one for me. The My... Meta Moon flavor. The final flavor. I've been eyeballing this one. Yeah, it's okay. Wait, really quick. The ice pop one is just white. It's just a pale white color. <laughs> I just stop myself from saying something awful. The Meta Moon. Meta Moon is not a flavor of anything. I've never tasted a moon, nor have I tasted one that's meta. So it'll be interesting to see what this is supposed to taste like. We left the space for you like to know? Maze if she came out, but she's, she's seeming to hibernate. She's afraid of rain and thunder when we adopted her, and uh, the people who had her originally kept her outside all winter. During rains and thunders, storms and floods. Up drink the drink! I'm trying to keep the history of the puppy. And so when it rains, she gets really upset and kind of hang eyes. Why does it smell like cologne? What? Okay, maybe not. What does it smell like to you? Cereal. Kind of root loops? But it's got like a chemical-iness to it. I don't know. More so than fruit loops. I like that. It tastes like fruit loops are tricks. I don't know, I, I never ate too much cereal as a kid, but I like that. That tastes that tastes good. I don't think it's better than the blue raspberry. Yeah, but it comes as a second. Oh, you're going that hard. Um, I might have to try the lemon lime again. To see if I agree with you on that. Don't worry, your lemon lime can be cool. I think it's a I think it's a personal preference too. If you like the lemon lime more, but more people are going to like this flavor. So I will give you the edge and I'll I'll, I'll we'll do it. So let's start ordering this from from best to the worst. So we, we All right, blue white green. Let's do the let's taste the blue again. You know what? That's actually conflicting with this now. It's actually getting in the way this one. I still like the blue one. Do you notice that? Like the the, 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 the the tartness of this one. It gives it a pickle juice effect. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that we know this still tasted roughly the best. I think, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, but it's interesting how the Meta Moon is affecting the flavor. It, it even did this one a little bit, too. So we'll do that. That's kind of cool, though. That is cool half on the table there, hopefully it'll stay. Followed by the Meta Moon. I mean, that just means the Meta Moon is powerful. Yes, it's... But not more powerful than Nostalgia! And the, we will do the... The Lemon Lime next. Now, we get into the question mark here. Um, what is fourth? Did you try these two? 
would say, well, I didn't like the rocket too much, so I would say pink. I'll give you that. I agree. I, I do believe you are onto something there. I would say next up is either rocket or red. Rocket. Rocket was better than red. <laughs> uh, red, red's pretty good. Um, then orange and yellow and gray. <clears throat> We're running out of room here, but... So, yell, ye lemon, and grape. So that would be our pick. From the right side of your screen. The blue the, the, the blue raspberry was the best. Followed by metamoon, followed by lemon-lime, followed by strawberry watermelon. Um, ice pop was probably not the worst... Uh, then you start going downhill roughly around the ice pop. The uh, fruit punch followed by the orange followed by uh, I would say the even the pink doesn't... I think I think it goes bop, 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 and then it's steep to the pink. Bop. Steep. Yeah, 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 yeah. The, the, the grape one's probably the worst, in our opinion. Uh, the lemon flavor was not as good. Um, I don't know why they did it. Honestly, um... But that's definitely hard. <laughs> the lemonade didn't appreciate you talking all that smack. Yeah, the lemon's actually fighting back. Um, the, the lemon... Here we go. Here we go. The lemon um, is definitely... And the grape are hard passes. Um, don't go out of your way to get those. Um, anything from orange and up, if they're easy to find, they're... they're, they're I think that's going to be I'll personal take, preference. What, it's the blue and the green are pretty easy to find, right? Yes, the blue and the green are very easy get to those. find. Get those. The meadow's cool if you can find it. Yeah. Um, the pink, pink one is really tolerable. Iffy. That one's not as hard to find, but I know it's not in, like the three packs at the stores and stuff. Uh, the red one is easy so to find. So it's actually the red, blue, and green that are in the three packs, right? Yeah, yeah, the triple I mean, flavor. I mean, that's not terrible. That's not terrible. I mean... The blue and the green are the best, and then you sadly drink the rest of the red one, or you offer that to people you don't like. Yeah, uh, little brother, you know? Because, yeah, these are not, like, that expensive at, like, Costco or Sam's. They have them at Sam's Club. Uh, they have the green, the blue, the green, the blue, and the red ones there. And then they have the sticks, which maybe we'll try on an episode um, of some powdered instant drinks that we have sitting around. But, ultimately, I mean... The best flavors are some of the easiest ones to find. Mm -hmm. With the exception of the red one maybe not being that great. But I'm sure there's people that like the And oops, the meta like moon not being one. super easy to find. Yeah, but there's your next flavor grouping is like the, the meta moon, the ice pop, and the orange. Just throw those three. I mean, I, I, I guarantee you they're going to probably put these three together in, a, in one. But I, I don't know. I don't know. But I'm we'll thinking see. of keeping an eye out for the blues and the whites. The blue and the white one, and for me, the green one. I, I'll I'll drink the green. I would happily drink the green one if it didn't cost three dollars and fifty cents a bottle. That white one, maybe though. I mean, that's like cereal flavor. You can't just get that. No. So if we saw that somewhere, we'd probably grab a couple. With the blue one, I'll just I'll just eat a lot. I will say though. Um, that's cool. That matches so well. Yeah, I will say with this experience though, and this is gonna be. Uh, I think tough for some people who really like this stuff, especially the kids. This is not cost effective. You're getting 12 fluid ounces for 350. You could easily buy two 20 some odd ounce, 24 ounce, 28 ounce Gatorades for the cost of one of these things. Here's what you do. And some of these taste like those Gatorades. Kids out there watching this, contact Logan Paul. Tell them to put fucking little QR code shitters on the bottle. All right, those are popular now. Link to a website, the website to advertise this shit. However, there's a tiny little corner of the website that's like, uh, enter for enter enter all your QR code bullshit for a giveaway. And then and then Logan, Logan, don't actually have a giveaway. Be scummy about it. Be like be like. Oh, there's not. Oh no, you you're gonna get. You're gonna get one prime a day, and it's just the fucking powder packets. <laughs> get to be in a video with Logan, you know? It's a video of a video. He makes the video himself, and then the kid stands in front of the video. And the green screen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Okay, jokes aside, jokes aside. Um, 
cost wise you could you could get you know some of the 7-eleven brand ones like the mango and the pomegranate acai are better than the ones that are here and you can get two of those for oh, oh you for mean, like three um, bucks those are closer to like body armors yeah no they're closer to this yeah, yeah the body armors are more have more you know those are cool refreshers mm -hmm. i think i think they're refreshers so i would argue that you're better off even getting those for price per you know and whatnot but uh what are you doing what are you doing don't do those let's do some science please oh no let's uh here. should we do this oh i know how i want to do this i want to do it like the best versus to the last. Yeah, yeah. We take a sip each time. Okay, Which would make the worst taste really worse because there's less of this in it. No, just put it all in there. If you're gonna, if you're gonna make me suffer. No, it's just white. Actually, hold on, hold on, hold on. So the blue one is just straight up white. Are these all white? And it's just the labels that make them look different colors. If that's the case, then I'm a little disappointed. But. Then again, no artificial, you know, coloring, right? That one actually looks completely clear. Uh, Hold on, I want to take a little swig of this. I don't know what this tastes like. Your favorite ones put together. No, we know that this one has color, so. That's actually good. <laughs> no, 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 we don't need to we don't need a king's cup the rest of this. We'll just leave it at that. Thank you. Well, we want to thank you guys for stopping by. And... No! <laughs> Enjoy it while it lasts, mortal. Enjoy it while it lasts. That's really good. <laughs> Logan Paul, please just like sell a mix of these two. We already got a name for it. Meta Blue Moon. Meta Blue Balls. Ow. Okay. <laughs> Here. I'll hold this up and you go in order and pour a little bit in. That Ooh, way we can see the his color. That one's got a tint of green to it, right? Yeah. So I think that the weird thing is the blue one was white. So now it looks kind of like moonshine or like some weird piss cum. <laughs> and now there's some blood in this it. This one has a bit of pink to it. You can see it. You can see it changing ever so slightly. Oh god, it's looking more like swamp water. Ah, switch. This one's clear. Yep. So I guess they decided not to add any blue coloring to the blue one. This one's a little red. Yeah, it looks like bath water. Why does this look like your bath water? No, it looks like bloody bath, like lightly blooded bath water. That one's a little orange. I'm gonna have space here. Orange so much. A little yellow tint to it. And then the last flavor. It looks like a nice little like cherry sprite that someone on TikTok would make. And then the grape. Yeah, the grapes are the one that's inside of the tint, I guess. Like hardcore. Yeah. Whoa! Smell it on you. Look at that. You don't need any more of this. I'll drink this, right? Drink it. Did you see how quill from the camera there? It did. It looked like it was eating it. What are the <laughs> we spilled KSI and Logan Paul's sweat on your pants. Look at this. It looks hor horrifying. But now it looks like strawberry lemonade. It's got like a grease, a grease film at the top. Yeah, something is separating it. Which is kind of scary. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm talking about on the top, but there's also, like, a separation forming, like, right there. You see that? Oh, shoot. What is that? 
Okay. Maybe the dot, some of the, the red dye is sinking further to the bottom than from the grape. I feel I'm afraid to drink. <laughs> you want me to drink it? No. You looked incredibly upset. I don't know what to call that. It's not terrible. The grape kind of coats the side of your mouth. Know? It's got like a tartness to it. It's a sweet tart. <laughs> The fruit punch and the, I and the uh, ice pop and the cereal will come through the most. I'm blue, I'm blue raspberry. I can't use your simulation on that. I don't know what the fuck you call that. It's fruit punch. It tastes like a different kind of fruit punch. Like a... Fruit punch extreme. Fruit punchy extreme, extreme, extreme. Okay, we, we've, we've kinks cupped a couple of things before. This is tolerable. Yeah. Don't get much of the lemon in there. Because I think this one overpowers it. Mm. Which is a good thing. The true lemonade. Well, the lemon lime. Okay. Um, I taste this and this pretty strongly. This is in there for sure. The grape. The orange I don't taste almost any of. I taste a lot of this too. Um, and, and a hint of this uh, as well. Which, like you said, because the way we did it would be less... Oh. Oh. Well, we did it. We tried all the flavors. We did it. Time. We did this. I mean, again, I, I, you know, chime in too. I, I don't think it's worth three dollars and fifty cents a bottle. Um, for a regular twelve flu. What is it? Twelve. It's two twenty at Target. Yeah, it is two twenty at Target. Sixteen point nine fluid ounces, where you could get literally almost double i actually think it's double this huh? or you can get two of those 7-eleven ones for three bucks and it's still about the same price for 220 this. for 220 for 220 I saw a little maybe. Tweet. i'm out i want a little tweet one of these two now sure. now here's another thing we didn't consider they might be cheaper in the big packs that's true but also like we go out sometimes, and you know, you're like, "Oh, grab yourself a little, little drink as a treat." And I look around, and all the drinks are three dollars. That's at the Don Quixote we go to. Yeah, right? but you know, this this isn't too bad. I was actually expecting like only two of them to be worth drinking, and the rest were going to be acid. It was these oh, two. we didn't show them. Well, no, I think it's better to not show them. You get more flavors. Sometimes chilling a beverage actually can cover up bad tastes and bad flavors. So there's a whole premise to doing that stuff. Um, but yeah, I would say this is a very fair lineup from, from best to worst being the two back here. All the way to here, you know, in that order. Um, but uh, it goes like with the energy drinks. There's better tasting stuff out there, roughly. But the Meta Moon especially is very unique. Blue raspberry flavor is actually pretty darn good. Um, and the Lemon Lime, and because these two come in those multi-packs as well as the powder packs, they might actually be worth seeking out. Um, you know you're going to have like that neighbor that likes the red flavor. Oh, yeah. Days. Yeah, or that one friend at school. Your cousin is like, hey, the arrangement is the best, and if you didn't like it, you, 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 I don't know what the kids say anymore these days. If you don't like orange, then you're just not swag. Bag it up, bro. Bag it up. Bag it up, bro. Hey, man. <laughs> um, but joke jokes aside, I mean, other than these two, I mean, I could see people liking this stuff. This one, maybe, like, we try some stuff. random dude out there, like, I really like that great flavor. I really like that lemon flavor. But, I mean, I we think... We try stuff, bag it up edition. We just drink it out of a wet paper bag. <laughs> but, uh... I had fun. I'm glad we did this. I'm glad we... You know, oh, yeah? You're glad we did this? I, I think so. I, I mean, this isn't terrible. Okay, there's a few regrets. But not, <laughs> nothing too bad. I mean, 
I will say this. Was it worth months of seeking them out every time we went out to look for other drinks? We kept an eye out for them. Uh, so we can make that footage for everyone. <laughs> All right. Not everyone's so lucky, Nick. That's true. Your friend in um, Ireland had pointed out that they're they're expensive. Six and a half they're dollars They're hard to each. find. Yeah, they're hard to find. Um... You can't get these in the fucking UK. That's where all the kiddos like them is the UK. Oh, you're right. You they, you you sent me an article on that, or something. Yeah. yeah, you sent me an article on that. But you know, ultimately, I mean. Now they know vaguely what they all taste like, and if you have to buy one using your mommy's credit card for twenty dollars off of eBay, you know which ones to go for. The Metamoon is probably the most expensive one. So you might be better off. You doing... know which one to go. For. Yeah, you might. But, um, yeah, I'm glad we did it. Logan Paul, you didn't make a completely terrible product. Um, clearly, you know. Um, but I don't think I would actively go out seeking this stuff. But that's just me, you know. But, you glad we did it? Yeah. Yeah. I like these two. This looks nostalgia for me. Mm. Little baby. I'll let you have the rest of that one. Maybe we'll even keep the bottle. We, we might have to. We might have to. Just for you. But you know what? Mm -hmm. There's one thing that Logan, Paul, and KSI could just never beat. The King's Cup? Oh no. Something far more. The King's Cup? Danger. King's Cup? Nope. Done. Done. Yeah! An entire six pack. Oh you know what, Nick? I'm sick of your fucking <laughs> shit. <laughs> you can't afford to rent this month because you keep buying fucking Macari sweat. Oh, let's wait till we install the fermenter out front. <laughs> what? Asylum. The Lord's been. Did you get the party requires no permit world. No permit at all. Oh. Are you fucking stupid? This oh. <laughs> way. Like, comment, subscribe. All the good things are taken on Twitch channel, Twitch TV, and Twitch Studios for more live reaction. And I gotta drink the King's Cup by myself. Hey, do you want any? No.